What's good, YouTube? Everybody, to here, back again, once again. Today, people, today we are here for episode number twenty. Twenty episodes in already. That's wild. Episode number twenty of our Pokemon Dark Rising Nuzlocke in our Year of Darkness Summer with the Squad, still going strong. In the last episode, you guys, we made our way here to what? 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 What the name? What the name here? Is, or did y'all city that we be in right here, right now? What? Fuck it. Iceland City. We are in Iceland City. Gosh darn it. Uh, last episode was actually us playing with fire. It was like a 45 minute long episode. Last two episodes are actually pretty, pretty hefty. Uh, if I do say so myself. I didn't, I didn't even realize that in, in the recording of them. Uh, but we play with fire by going through uh, the mansion, Amaris' mansion, and Kiram's den with only three adequately leveled mons. And uh, I don't know if you guys have been paying attention to Dark Riding so far, but kind of wild to do that so you missed all that definitely make sure you go back and check it out in today's episode we're gonna be exploring iceland city and hopefully finally taking on another gym i'm so excited yes ah! Woo! Woo! so if you guys are hyped as well and of course we're gonna show you support the proud of the happy nation make sure to like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated now i did do some grinding in between episodes i want you guys to know um a lot of technicalities went down between last episode and this episode because we did the whole playing with fire and traveled through those two areas and attempt to find a new place to grind and without continuing and finding stuff out that isn't in an episode you know exploring new areas there's literally nowhere for me to grind we cannot backtrack through Kerem's den uh because of the way the game is made uh to the area that i did grinding before so uh i had to actually sit down break down and actually use an exp code um i was going uh to try and do a few different things but ultimately using the exp code was the best option for us and uh i don't know if it was like a 5000 exp code or whatever i don't i didn't seem like it but it basically took like three hours of grinding and compressed it into about 30 minutes which was glorious it was very very glorious i don't mind grinding i've said this a hundred thousand times but when it becomes unproductive that's when it bothers me that's when it really bothers me. In the last, like, the last three episodes, I recorded all at once. And, like, the three episodes were recorded across, like, a five-hour session. And, you know, <laughs> to get three episodes out of five hours worth of your time is not worth it at all. It was just, when you do more grinding than you do play in the game, that's when it becomes crazy. So, let's get a quick squad recap for you guys, because things have changed. Things have changed. I will tell you right now, Wanda, the wheezing, is not on the team. And I will show you guys why here in a second. Wanda was replaced by backup, our Blitzel, which is now a Zeep Striker. Uh, level 68, Lonely Nature, with Lightning Rod, Rocking Thunderbolt, Stomp, Overheat, and Thunder Wave. Hmm. Up next, we have Henrietta, who is the most dysfunctionally functional Dust Noir you have ever seen in your life. Naive Nature, my right button is not working, uh, with Pressure, Rocking Brick Break, Ice Punch, Rock Slide and Thunder Punch. Um, I had Will O Wisp on Henrietta, uh, but I got rid of it because we have Will O Wisp on Muchacho. Um, but this is literally the best moveset Henrietta gets. I have a feeling Dustwire doesn't actually get these moves by level up. I wouldn't be surprised if it's an egg move for him. Um, but I don't think Dustwire gets these moves by level. Actually, you know, what? I'm gonna go and check right now. Because that would be some shit if Dust Noir actually gets all the elemental punches by level up. It's one of those things where, like, I can see it, I can believe it, but at the same time, it's hard to believe. And lo and behold, he does not get these moves by level up. He gets them at level 1, so you can hard scale them back on. Um, but he did get all these by level up. And all I wanted the entire time when I was grinding him was a ghost type move. That's it. His attack stat is colossal, much higher than his special attack stat, and all I wanted was a ghost type move. And he never learned Shadow Punch. So unless he gets it at like level 70 or 75, Dark Rising Debs, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Why did you give him Rock Slide by level up, but not Shadow Punch? What's going on? Like, I, just something stab will be dope. But either way, his moveset is still something that can be worked with, so we're gonna try our best to work with it. Then we have Jehuti, our Scizor, Docile Nature, level 68, with Swarm, Rockin' X Scissor, Swords Dance, Iron Head, and Roost. The same moveset. I don't think it's going to change. We have Muchacho, our Victini, level 68, Naive Nature, with Serene Grace, Rockin' Fire Punch, Thunder Punch, Psychic, and the aforementioned Will-O-Wisp. 
And then we have Xavier. It's very unfortunate uh, what happened to Ezekiel, but <laughs> may Magnolia and Ezekiel rest in peace. Uh, Xavier has now picked up the baton and is our new powerhouse on the squad. Hardy Nature <laughs> with Intimidate, and you can guess the moveset: set, Hurricane, Iron Head, Hydro Pump, and Dragon Dance. I do not care we are playing Dark Rising, and as long as they give me Magikarps, I will take them, and we will have a mighty, mighty Gyarados on the squad, okay? I promise we'll take a break from Gyarados for a couple of LPs after this, but you gotta, you gotta give me some sort of tools to beat this <laughs> craziness of a game. And then last but certainly not least, we have Ignacio, our starter Pokemon, our Garchomp, level 68, with bold nature holding the Dragon Fang with Sandbell, Rock and Dragon Pulse, Iron Head, Earthquake, and Swords Dance. So the squad is looking a little unconventional, but it's working. It makes me very sad that Wanda wasn't able to be uh, saved, but Wanda, um, I don't know if you guys know this, but Weezing is literally the suicide Pokemon. Um, Wanda... I did train her up to level 68, uh, but look at her moveset. Look at Wanda's moveset. Sludge, Explosion, Smokescreen, and Haste. If you go back to the last episode, or two episodes ago when we first caught Wanda, Wanda's moveset was Sludge, Self-Destruct, Smokescreen, and Haste. The only thing that Wanda learns by level up is Explosion, Destiny Bond, Memento, like all these moves that <laughs> involve Wanda essentially killing herself and I it's Weezing's actual level up moveset like what Pokemon company why why did you make Weezing such a <sighs> What like why it, it literally got no good moves I don't have any TMs to teach it so I figured what would be most effective for the team and I went ahead and snagged back up instead It's really upsetting because a Weezing would literally fit perfect on this team It would give us just the right amount of bulk uh, especially paired with an Intimidate Gyarados like it's it would literally just be perfect it would literally just be perfect but wasn't meant to be so our team's not as bulky um, if I do get any sort of TMs that will help then I'll definitely go ahead and snag Wanda and slap her back on the squad but for now she's just gonna chill right there either way we're here in Iceland City it's time for us to explore ties ladies and gentlemen most people live in the underground city now. If it wasn't for the hot food restaurant, Iceland City would be a ghost town. It's just way too cold to live here for long. In the underground city, are these houses? Are these houses? That boy has an item. That boy has an item. That girl with the shades is creeping me and my little brother out. Yippee! I'm on vacation. My sis brought me along. Awesome. Pokemon. I know this hotel for people. We're full up, unfortunately. What? I'm not bothering them. Okay. All right, buddy, you, you do you, big dog. I'm not judging. You should check out the underground city, it's cool. This underground city just seems like be the motherfucking place to be. I wanna go to the musical in Numacity. Numacity, my brother's waiting on me, but those guys are blocking the way, hmm. Okay. I'm glad those thugs left out of here, bunch of punks. Thanks for the coin case, dog. Dog? Those annoying thugs slap my butt when I pass by. Ha! Hi! Sorry, but we're taking a break right now. I can't get food. I can't get a place to stay. What's going on, Doc? Hello? Stay out of our way, kid. We're going to get the job done for our master. Ha ha! All right. I guess they have room and board. I don't, though. It's too cold to play outside in the snow, so I mostly stay on TV and watch all day. My favorites are Inuyasha, Bleach, and Beyblade. Oh, and I love Naruto, too. Say, what's your favorite shows? Uh, I have a lot. Gotta go. This thing is a week. Oh, I thought I got trapped. The Prince of the Blizzard. So he's an ice-type gym leader. Ooh. Oh, dog, it's Steven. There's so many items here. Dog, it's Steven. It's Steven! I need some ice heels! Iceland City was hit so hard by a blizzard, tons of people decided to be safer to live underground. I'm not scared, though. It's not like you did your homework. I feel like it would be colder underground, though. Hi there. May I help you? Hyper potions. Hyper potions. <gasps> we have hyper potions! Yes! Dog, give me 99. Give me 99 hyper potions. Now! Now! <laughs> I want them now, you bitch! 
Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm gonna buy ice heels too because we're here. Dog, we are stocking the fuck up! Dog, we got the money for it too. I ain't even worried about it. Dog, next time we, uh, 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 next time we get to some trainers that I can rebattle, I will go ahead and, uh, rebattle them and get our supplies back up. I'm not worried about it. But for now, I am beyond ecstatic, EXK static, that uh, I even fucking have hyper potions, dog. I was so happy. Oh, we can sell this big pearl. Get this out of here. Oh, wait. Oh, we got, oh, I forgot I picked up a shit ton of them. <laughs> I forgot I picked up. <coughs> I can't move, the, I can't move the hyper potions? Uh, oh, wait. Oh, I was in the cell menu. Oh. I was about to say, I can't move my hyper potion? What the fuck's going on here? Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so beyond happy. You guys don't even know. You don't understand. Like, that takes so much, so much off of me. Like, oh, so happy we have hyper potions now. Whew. All right. So, I'm not going to talk to Steven just yet. I want to continue to exploratize Iceland City here. I love Lucky Eggs lit hey thanks dude oh don't tell me oh my god oh my god. what's going on dark rising what's going on <laughs> hold on i want to see how much does a lucky egg sell for can i get back to 999 right now real quick how much does a lucky egg sell for only a hundred bucks yikes <laughs> yikes you know what i'm gonna i'm I ain't got nothing else to give my mons, dog. I got a uh, what you call holding a um a uh, dragon fang, so he can hold on to that for now. But you know what? I, as hard as it is to grind in this fucking game or to get experience in this game, you damn skippy. I slap lucky eggs on everybody, everybody. Yeah. All right, we got lucky eggs on the squad. <laughs> Oh, the entire squad. What a lonely city. Somebody left a comment a couple episodes back saying that it would be okay if I were to go and catch a starter Pokemon. Because you remember I mentioned that starter mons have experience shares on them. And then dump the starter mon just to get the experience share. And then somebody was like, well, Nappy has a TM for Thief. Do I actually? I do have a TM for Thief. So I could go back and teach somebody Thief and try and get an experience share off of a starter. Only issue is, unless they give me Fly, I can't go back. Because we can't trek back through Kiram's Den. So, big yikes. Underground City. Oh. Wait a second. Hold up. An Ether. Can that respawn? Oh, that one doesn't fucking respawn. What the hell? Hey, hold on. Before I go to the Underground City. Taunt. Hmm. Hmm. Can we go in here? Can I peep it? Yo. Oh shit. Stop meddling with us. Oh. Fuck. Um. I think I'm gonna go back and speak to. You can intimidate me, but Ice Punch is kicking your ass, nigga. Okay, yeah, so the experience code is turned off. I turn it off, but you know, sometimes it's finicky like that. I didn't see what mon they're sending out. Oh, I can thunder punch this whore. Why do you have a level 42 tentacle? That lucky egg makes so much of a difference, dog. That's insane. You see how much experience you get from, I mean, they are trainer battles, but you see how much experience you get? That's wild. Hold on, I wanted to talk to this dude. We're taking over, scram, kid. Oh, it's Kai. Steven is Kai. Oh, that's dope. The gym is closed due to some difficulties. Oh, so we are supposed to go to the underground city. Okay. Okay. I see you, big dog. I see you, big Don't worry. I got this. I got this. I got this. These, these niggas ain't shit. Who are you? How did you get here? Oh, so the underground city has, like, pools in it. Oh. Mm. Okay. I understand now. I'm with it. I understand why they're underground. Cause I'm gonna say, like, isn't that how like settlers used to like keep meat back in the day? What the fuck? I clicked on an item and they battled me. 
What the fuck? <laughs> what the hell is going on here, dog? I can't do it. KO will deal with you. Okay. <laughs> I, I was a trainer. <laughs> fuck me, apparently. Um. What was I gonna say? I don't even remember what the fuck I was talking about. What the fuck was I even talking about? I don't know. I got a rare candy. Ooh, hot damn. Kale will pwn me, apparently. You're done here. Kale will pwn me. Oh, he's got the same on just evolved. Oh. Oh. Oh, and speaking of. Shut up all! If I would have just leveled it up one more, oh my god, that's great. Okay, I'm not gonna get rid of Brick Break on him though, because Brick Break helps with dark types. So let me think about this. Let me think about this. I went on a whole rant at the start of this episode, and in one level he got Ghost Type move. Um, so Brick Break I want to keep for dark types. I like that. Ice, I think Ice Punch I can get rid of. Because the only thing Ice Punch, well no, Ice Punch gives me coverage over ground types. Not that I'm weak to them. Ground types, just in the sense of what I can cover, and the other moves can't. So I'm gonna say it again, ground types, <laughs> dragon, and flying, and grass. Rock slide takes care of flying as well. I think ice punch is a little more detrimental. Thunder punch only really helps with water types? And I think it comes down to either Rock Slide or Thunder Punch, because Rock Slide helps with fire types, bug types, ice types, but I have Brick Break. Thunder Punch helps with water. Uh, I think I'm gonna get rid of Thunder Punch. I think I'd rather keep Ice Punch. I don't know. I'm gonna get rid of Rock Slide. Fuck it. Why not? Why not? You were never meant to have Rock Slide to begin with. Fuck it. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Fuck it. Okay, hold the phone. We have a stab maneuver. Oh, it's delicious. It's delicious. And you know, I know we're in here right now. We're doing things. But slow your roll real quick and peep this. Because speaking of evolutions, look at what I found in the grass here while I was grinding. Peep, 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 peep. It's the rare encounter, so it might take a second. It's the rare encounter, so it might take a second. Hold up. Hold up. Cub Chew. It's lit. It's lit. It's lit. It's lit. Snow Runt. It's lit. It's lit. It's lit. It's lit. Skarmory. It's lit. It's lit. It's lit. It's lit. Cub Chew. It's lit. It's lit. It's lit. It's lit. Cub Chew. It's lit. It's lit. It's lit. It's lit. Okay, come on, dog. Why is it now that I want to to show this mon off? It's not here. Swine. Swine up. Not you, swine up. Not you. No. No. It's the rare encounter, so I'm. I just wanted to, this episode to be cool. And then show you guys there's a deli bird. Maybe we can't. Snover. This bitch is no toxic. Aggravating as shit. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to. Why won't you show up? <laughs> Why won't you show up? Please. I'm gonna give it five more chances. That's one. That's two. That's three. That's four. That's five. Okay, so the rare encounter on this route is a Glaceon. I know I said five more and I'm still going. Rare encounter on this route is a Glaceon. Cause remember I mentioned Eevee has the evolution in this game, but you can only evolve it into uh, Jotown, Flareon, Vaporeon, Espeon, and Umbreon. Uh, Glaceon and Leafeon are in the game. You just have to catch them separately in the wild. And you can find Glaceon here. It's just the rare encounter on the route. And I'm just not meant to... I wish you know, I saw like four dozen of these bitches when I was grinding. And now, they're nowhere to be found! 
Leave me alone. I don't want to talk. I don't want to talk. Y'all mind if I just sulk for the rest of the episode? <laughs> Y'all care if I just do a little bit of sulking, huh? Anyways, back to what we were supposed to be doing. Back to our regularly scheduled programming. Who this is? Kale will deal with you. Frustration. Look at these shitty TMs. Fuck me, apparently. Nigga don't want to talk. <laughs> Nigga don't want to talk. I got calcium. Oh. Black glasses. Do we really just get another held item? Oh, it's unfortunate. I don't have any mon that's a dark type or any mon that knows any dark type moves. Not a single motherfucker on the squad. <laughs> dark typing is not represented at all. Just went to the Pokemon Center, but that's cool. All right, nigga. Well, if it isn't Nappy, coming to save the day, are you? Kale, what are you doing here? I heard that Ruby is in this city, but some punk with a scrafty took it. Pete? Time to destroy you once and for all. I didn't even know Pete had a scrafty. Have we battled Pete in a scrafty yet? Or battled Pete while he had a scrafty? I don't remember. A Weavile? Ah! Oh! It's a wee file, yo. I'm gonna overheat this bitch right now. Slash me, whore. Slash me, whore. Whoa, 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 Again, crit turn one. I know slash is a high chance to crit, but fucking relax, dog. That didn't even kill! What? Hold up. Dog, you think he has pursuit? I'm gonna go out to JOT. I was, you know what's crazy is I sat here and said, you think he has pursuit? With the notion of like, I was gonna play this nigga with his slash. That was a crit, you bitch. Crit me again. That he was gonna click slash and I was gonna go out to Henrietta, but then what do I do? Because then he's gonna come hit me with a dark type move and I'm not trying to get fucked like that. This nigga clicked beat up. Zorark. Ferrothorn. Reuniclus. Dog, I'm mad. Hydragon, dog, I'm. I'm Big mad dog. I should have clicked Swords Dance. I could Oko all those mons with Jehuti. What the fuck? A Zoroark. Watch this thing have like flamethrower or some shit, dog. Does Zoroark get flamethrower? I feel like it does. I know there was a there was a event sludge bomb. Uh, Zoroark. Shadow Claw. Ooh. What's with all these moves that have a high chance to crit? Fuck off, Kale. What the hell? And this nigga's a higher level than me still. Yeah! I get a critical hit. That's what the fuck I want to see, dog. That's what I want to see. Reuniclus. I'm gonna go out to JOT. I'm a little concerned about my HP. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm a little concerned about my HP, and I'm a little interested, I'm curious, as to what he's going to use. It's so nice. This nigga has thunder! <laughs> this nigga just pulled right the fuck up, dog. Oh my god, I want you to know, if I would've stayed in, that does so much damage. Holy fuck, dog. Nah, nigga, you, you missing this thunder. You went for water pulse. Okay, I think I can live with thunder. I don't think this X is gonna kill. I've learned my lesson. I was gonna say, I learned my lesson. Oh, you bitch! Oh, you dead now, ho. You dead now, ho. You dead now, ho. You dead now, ho. Yeah. Yeah. I was gonna say, I learned my lesson taking on Reuniclus with Vincent. Oh, gone too soon. Hydreigon. This nigga's gonna have a fire type move. What the fuck do I do to Hydreigon, dog? <laughs> like, I wanna stay in with Jehuti, but. Ah. Uh, I feel like I'm asking to lose my scissor. I feel like he's gonna have like fire blast or something. I mean that Reuniclus just had thunder. Um, I don't think, I mean he gets fire fang as an egg move. Um, I don't think he gets a fire type move that leveled. I don't know High Dragon's moveset as well as other mons that are my favorites. It's just one of those things where it's like no matter who I send out, it's a fucking High Dragon. I'm just gonna, please don't have flamethrower. Please don't have Fire Blast. Please don't have Flamethrower. Try Attack! Okay, that's normal. That's resisted. 
And it's not stab. Yo. That's fine as long as we break through. Yo. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yo, peep what I'm about to do. Peep what I'm about to do. Yo. Fuck your tri attack, nigga. This motherfucker pulled up with hyper beam. What in the fuck, dog? Hold up. He's at, I'm guessing. So he's got to have tri attack, hyper beam. A dark type move and a dragon type move. Dark pulse and dragon pulse, I'm guessing. This motherfucker has hyper beam. Holy shit. If he doesn't have a dark type move, then my nigga is screwed. I thought for sure he would have like, yo, let me get this shell bell. Hold up, let's redo this battle and let me use thief. Whose cry is that? Bronze on? What the fuck was that? A pharaoh thorn. Okay, this Ferrothorn can get SMACKED! Alright, look here, dog. You see you next Tuesday, whore. Whore. You whore. Yeah, 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 yeah. Delicious damage. Delicious damage. Mmm, muchachos coming. Look at this experience with these lucky eggs, dog. What is grinding? Mmm. What? This cannot be true. Oh, surprise, surprise, nigga. So, you're not weak after all. I'm impressed. Where's Pete? In a far worse situation than you can ever imagine. Ah! What have you done to him? Hmm. Really worried, are you? Farewell, Nappy, for now. Wait! Great, he's gone again. I don't fuck you, nigga. You didn't want to talk to me before. I ain't trying to talk to you now. Thank you for getting rid of those nasty thugs. Though someone took off with the ruby. Don't worry, sir. I'll find it. Ah, oh, thank you, trainer. You are indeed kind. Here, this might help you. HMO2 contains fly. Use it to fly to areas you already visited. Though, you'll need the mystic badge for you to use it outside of the field. Thank you. This would really help me a lot. Well, I guess Iceland City is back to normal. You should go challenge my son, Kai. He's a pretty strong one, that's for sure. Don't worry, I'm ready for any kind of challenge. That's the spirit. I'll be at my house if you need me. I only chased these thugs because they took control over my house. Well, good luck on your journey. I'm not gonna want to talk to me before. I'm, I'm gonna save that encounter from when we're ready to leave Iceland City, Doug. That's what I'm gonna do. But this is the underground city where everyone's supposed to be living. No one's in the fucking underground city. What in the fuck? But you know what? Hey, yo, today's episode has been an episode of answers because I. <laughs> I was like, yo, Dark Rising, where the fuck is my staff move on my Dust Noir? Boom. I can't go back and get an experience here unless I get fly. Boom. <laughs> Anyways, I think we're actually going to save the gymnasium for the next episode. Ha 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 ha. Cliffhanger. And after that, we can fly back to, I think there were Bulbasaur's in the first forest. I think there were Cyndaquil's in the Lava Path, wherever it was. So I know where some starters are. I just don't know what the likelihood of getting an item off them is or whatever. Either way, we'll figure it out in the next episode. If you guys enjoyed today's episode of Dark Rising, and of course, want to show you support as a proud member of the Nappy Nation, make sure to like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. And I'll catch you guys next time. Until then, I'm Audi 5 Bajillion. Bye!